नमस्कार हेलो एंड वेलकम टू डॉक्टर चजलानीज यूट्यूब वीडियो चैनल दिस प्रेजेंटेशन इज ऑन प्लेक्सीफॉर्म न्यूरोफाइब्रोमोटोसिस एंड दिस इज हाउ इट कैन मैनिफेस्ट इन सो मेनी पॉसिबल वेज नमस्कार डॉक्टर चजलानी के यूट्यूब वीडियो चैनल में आपका स्वागत है हम इस बार आपको न्यूरोफाइब्रोमा या प्लेक्सीफॉर्म न्यूरोफाइब्रोमेटोसिस के बारे में जानकारी देंगे दिस इज not a very common disease and can occur in one out of 4000 persons and it manifests as small brown color patches or small nodules size of a pea to size of a lemon and this is the plexiform version so it's a genetic disorder of the nerves and is not very common and it can uh, manifest as a neurofibroma in the form of colored patches or small nodules and it can occur anywhere in the body caution is needed because some of them can turn malignant though in a very small instance and they can cause pain and can have other manifestations also basically there is no treatment for for uh, or there is no cure for neurofibroma but the, the disease can be uh, taken care of by removing it to an extent and there are some drugs available which is under trial and this is how the disease manifests and it can be taken care surgically to reduce the bulk most of the people making uh, or coming to us are basically wanting the visible part to be taken care of especially on the face and and the arms so that they can look better or they can function better but it is known to occur anywhere in the body on outside and as well as inside and depending on where it is present it can cause pain and most of the people who ask for treatment is basically to correct the facial disfigurement as you can see in most of these slides where we cannot make a lot of them people uh, people normal but they can be still made much much better than what they are all neurofibromas and plexiform neurofibromas need not be removed but they can be removed to the extent that the person starts functioning better and looking better and that's what they present for and if pain is present it can be taken care of by painkillers but if it is not dealt with in time it can acquire huge proportions and the surgery becomes difficult the larger it is so the best is to treat it early so just to summarize it's also called, called as von recklinghausen's disease which is a genetic disorder mek inhibitors is a new drug which is known to reduce it but otherwise surgery is needed in most of the patients who have deformities thank you for listening to our presentation thank you and welcome once again